The Cancer Institute has really a premier place among cancer centers. What we bring is the best research, really with application. We are applying our research in both basic science and population-based science to the patient. In biomedicine, we're faced all the time with intractable problems, and cancer is one of these problems that are very difficult to solve. Often, these problems are solved by thinking about problems from a completely different perspective, and that's the kind of attitude and approaches that we foster at Stanford. Being in a position to be able to make patients better and be there with them as they travel through that journey is a really powerful thing to be able to do every day. Stanford has really all of the elements to be an intellectual leader. We need incredible science and an incredible understanding of the immune system, and so it's a natural fit to the scientific community that's here. The most exciting science typically happens when groups from different disciplines or with different points of views come together. We have pioneers in the research for immunotherapy, molecular targeting of cancer, the genetics of cancer, and we have pioneers in radiation therapy and technology and the biological interactions of all of these different treatments. And it's an extremely rare combination to have strengths across the board in all of those different areas. You got cells in you, they're still working. The Stanford Cancer Institute is combining that science with the clinical trial needs in order to translate the research of the laboratories into patient cures. What's unique about the Stanford Cancer Institute is the people. Our faculty, our staff is committed to making sure that our cancer patients get the best they deserve. It is a unbelievable collection of faculty members and their trainees who are world leading in many different areas of cancer research. It's so inspiring to be at a place like this where there's great scientists, great clinicians, and great communication between them. Stanford is a terrific place for somebody like me that wants to be both involved in laboratory research and uh, patient care and mostly applying that research to advances in patient care because it's all right here on this one campus. Stanford has a very collaborative culture. More than 400 faculty participate in the Cancer Institute. One of our major missions is to promote the collaboration and interaction of all those individuals, and really we've been able to bring all of this expertise to the benefit of our patients. How have you been feeling? The NCI designation is something that is much sought after by cancer centers, so we were very pleased in 2007 to be able to be designated as a cancer center, and then in 2016 we got the comprehensive designation. I think the recognition as a comprehensive cancer center creates a recognition of what Stanford has always done, which is make major contributions to cancer and to our cancer patients.